welcome back okay so today I wanted to kind of find some inspiration for my eye look because I didn't really know what color I wanted to do so I grabbed this sweater that I picked up from Old Navy recently just you know kind of like a striped green um, what is it kind of like a mustard and blue type turtleneck sweater something you just wear in the cold weather and the palette that I decided to kind of play off with this sweater is either my Stacy Marie Antidote or my Menagerie Cosmetics Well Song palette. And I feel like even though the Antidote palette has some nice greens and golds to kind of play around with, I really wanted to incorporate a little more blue in this look. So I'm leaning more towards the Menagerie palette. The Whale Song palette is absolutely gorgeous, you guys. I know with Menagerie, it's like they sell out, they're limited edition, they're hard to get. You gotta wake up at the crack of dawn to try and grab a palette, but I'm so glad I got this palette. It is so pretty. The mattes are magnificently pigmented and the shimmers are shimmering, as you can see. So, so beautiful. So I think I'm going to work with this palette today to create my look to go with this sweater. Okay, you guys, so let's go ahead and jump right in. <laughs> so yeah, I'm pretty excited to try out this Whale Song palette. You guys know I love blues and greens and this palette is gorgeous. So before I get started, I do wanna go ahead and clean up my brows a bit. You guys know at this point in the game, I am like super lazy when it comes to my brows. Just going in with a little bit of concealer and cleaning up my brows. Um, the micro, micro blading, <laughs> it's just, it's made me so happy. It has, it's made me so happy. It saved me so much time and stress. You know, I even like a more natural kind of look for my brows nowadays. So just going in with some of my P. Louise base. And as you can see, I'm just gently tapping it across my lid. So the first shade I'm going into is this beautiful, like super bright green shade, which is called Kelp. Using a pretty large fluffy brush to just tap that in the inner corner. I kind of have an idea of what I want to see with this look. And I really want these colors to pop in my crease and on my inner corner so i'm just kind of tapping it down and making sure that pigmentation stays nice and bright so the next color i'm going into is bubble net it's a blue shade kind of like a blue green shade honestly leaning more on the blue side though and i'm just taking a medium-sized fluffy brush tapping that in that crease area as you can see gently blending it into that lighter shade of green. I decided I wanted to take the residue off of that green brush and just kind of blend out the edge of that blue. <clears throat> so now I'm going in with this more <laughs> powerful and potent blue, the shade Breaching, and I'm just tapping that in the outer corner because I want that blue to really show up. But the main color for this look is the green. So once again, I'm going in with a little bit more of that bright green shade, blending out the edge of that blue, and just kind of making this whole eye look come together using that fluffy brush to just blend everything, you know, to make it cohesive. Y'all know what I mean. <laughs> so yeah, just doing the other side with that blue, tapping it down to keep that pigment, and then just blending it out the edges with that green shade. I love these colors together. So this is what we have so far, you guys. I definitely wanna kinda of clean it up just a little bit. So just taking a wet wipe and just doing a gentle kinda of sharper edge on that outer corner. 
Now for the shimmers, I'm going into this beautiful bright green shade called Fluke. Gorgeous, you guys. Super, super gorgeous. I do recommend spraying their shimmers um, because you can get fallout with them. They are a little bit more chunky than some other shimmers that I've used. But the pigmentation is just remarkable. So it's worth it <laughs> to deal with the chunkiness. Next, I'm going into Splash. Beautiful darker green uh, shimmer shade placing that like on the outer portion of my lid as you can see just gently blending it into that blue gently blending it into that lighter green shimmer so I really wanted to make sure that that kelp shade in the inner corner popped because that's just giving me that extra brightness of green right there in that inner corner so I'm just going in and doubling down on that shadow and as you can see, it really reinforces how that looks right there. We're going to do a little bit more of a dramatic lash going in with the Kiss Lash Couture Triple Push Triple Push Up Collection Lashes. Really, really like these with this look. I mean, it really kind of adds that depth and shadow on the outer portion of the lid for this look. As you can see, I didn't go in with any liner at all not black not colored i just left the shadow to kind of shine on its own and i'm using the lashes for that outer corner shadow really really like these like them a lot so this is what we have for this eye look you guys let's go ahead and see how well i did matching it with the sweater hello <laughs> i think i did pretty good with um using this sweater kind of as a guide for what i wanted to do for this eye look I believe that it matches pretty well. A little bit of blue, a little bit of green. Got that light pop in the center, so it worked out quite nicely. Let me know what you guys think. I feel like I had a lot of fun actually picking a, a clothing item and matching it. So I just kept on my gold accessories, have my Rolex watch matching. Definitely going in with my Valentino scent that my girl Lily sent me. Oh my gosh, it smells amazing okay if you guys haven't smelled valentino this one <laughs> definitely check it out smells amazing so just to share with you the rest of my look i threw on some fashion nova dark denim jeans stretchy i have on some of my made by you nikes that have like army green on them so it kind of ties in with my sweater I also paired it with this cute little Steve Madden purse and I think it matches perfectly. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Thank you so much and I will see you on the next one. Toodles!